but it's, it looks like a fully rendered out, um, detailed out interior space, right? So parallax windows, um, for those D5 users, this is probably nothing new for you, but, um, but um, this is gonna be something that I think is gonna be helpful depending on what you do for your, for your, um, for your visuals, um, especially when it comes to sort of background context, or maybe if you're doing larger buildings like a skyscraper or something and you don't, you, you're still massing it out and not showing the um, interior or even modeling the interiors yet. So what is a parallax window? Well, I've got my little fancy facade that I built over here so we can use this as a testing, a testing example. So if I take this office and I, and I plop it in here, what you'll see is if I look at it on this side, oh, the blinds are down. If I spin this around, you can see it's basically, it's a flat surface, but when you spin around, and hopefully you guys can see that pretty smooth, um, you can see it looks kind of like a 3D object, even though it's a flat surface, right? So now, as you can see, as I'm looking through it, you know, it's, it's background, it's context, and hopefully you guys can see that, but it's, it looks like a fully rendered out, um, detailed out interior space, right? Um, so that's super cool. And so what that allows you to do is obviously allows you to quickly make a whole bunch of context stuff. Um, I think that's a really cool technology that's been added, um, but having it now is, is awesome and I'm excited. Um, uh, it works, but it was ne never nearly as, as cool as this. So parallax windows, very, very cool.